I'm Bill Schultz. Um, it was 2003, 2004 that I was here playing. Um, outside, started as a middle, went to outside, and then my senior year I was playing right side. I would say my athletic career playing volleyball here is my whole life. I, um, I met my wife playing volleyball. Um, my kids now, I mean, I got a nine-year-old and uh, a seven-year-old, and they are into volleyball now. They go, I coach. So now that I've been, I've been coaching for 23 years at my former high school, my kids are involved, they go to the games, it's just, they get to go to practices. So being here and continuing to play, because it didn't look like I was playing a play after I was at um, Nyer Community for a while. It looked like it was gonna end and getting the opportunity to come here and continue to play was awesome. The game that I had, uh, I think it was 35 kills in one match. I think I did it twice. I did it against Finlay, Ohio, and then we did it against um, Mercyhurst. So those were my two highs as, as that, and also the interview I had for Volleyball Magazine. That was pretty cool. It was always fun playing, to me, as being a D3 athlete, going and having that competition of, you know, I think Finlay, Ohio was D2 at the time and Mercyhurst was Division One. so we got to, to go play those games. It was always a goal of mine to, you know, prove them that I could have played at that level and, you know, pushed. When it happens, I don't think you're really thinking about the record, like that happening, you're just playing, you know, it was, you know, you go out and you're just trying to win that match, so whatever it took, I was out there just trying to help us get through that game to get that win. You know, I knew here that I was getting better, so I knew that it, I still wanted to try to reach the level of professional. I didn't really play a lot of outdoor when I was playing indoor here, um, but I still wanted to continue playing volleyball. And with us having down the road in Rochester, there was a beach there at Charlotte, and, and I just continued to play, and, and it was it was fun. And then I, uh, a Hutton was here too, at the, still at the time, and did the media blast. And then when I did finally qualify, I mean, we were the lowest seed to get in, but which mean we had to play the number one team, which was the number one team in the world at the time, which was Delhauser and Rogers, and they ended up winning the Olympics that year. I mean, it was quite the experience, and I'm glad that I got here, got better, and had the ability to go out and play and continue my career. You know, I struggled academically here. Um, there was a few teachers here, and I was struggling in the Spanish class, and it was, you know, on the verge of hurting my eligibility to be able to continue to play. But she went out of her way and, you know, tutored me and helped me get through so I could keep my eligibility. You know, I had a lot of family help. Um, both my sisters, Courtney and Roberta, both helped me, you know, helped me with my schooling and stuff like that, tutoring me too. Uh, so I would like to throw out their names there for, and thanks. I mean, my parents for helping me be able to afford to come here. Um, they did a lot for me too. They traveled to every game. They videotaped a lot so I could see, you know, what I was doing on the court and self-assess myself. And I'd like to thank John Hutton too for giving me the opportunity to continue to play the game of volleyball. I mean, I was really passionate about it and there wasn't really a huge avenue to continue and it was great to be able to come here and do that. I don't like really boasting of my, myself, but I, I feel like this just shows how you can achieve things and you're honoring me by all the hard work that I came in here in this gym and, and played hard and worked out in the weight room that used to be in the basement and now there's a nice fancy one out there. Um, I'm just, I'm really grateful to Duville for doing this and the athletic department and you know my former coach for giving me the opportunity to come here and play. It's, a, it's huge, I'm really grateful for it. I really thank, thank you very much for it.